football player. He is also a pro football Hall of Famer, and he's also one of the nicest men you will ever meet. Pro football Hall of Famer Jackie Smith. Welcome back. Whoa. I'll call him back. Let's um, – He's the nicest man you'll ever meet, but apparently didn't pay his cell phone bill. No, no I'm kidding. Hey, uh, Jackie Smith, um, a couple of years, well, we're, we're going back a, a couple He's years. Back. He hoodwinked me to go to his, uh, oh, Jackie Smith, are you there? I'm here. Uh, maybe if we have time later, you'll sing us a little Danny Boy. <laughs> well, it's. The, past, the time has just passed for that. So, okay, all uh, right. But we we'll give it a shot anyway. <laughs> all right, fair <laughs> enough. Uh, you're you're always welcome here. Uh, that's for sure. But you are involved with a a great uh, event to raise money. Tell us about this this Vietnam Wall that is coming to uh, Missouri. Oh well, thank you very much. Thanks for giving us the opportunity. Well, it's going to be everybody's going to know about it uh, sooner or later. It's going to be uh, really um, uh, a highlight for. Uh, from Missouri, uh, but we're building a, uh, a, a Missouri National Veterans Memorial uh, right outside of Perryville, Missouri, and uh, right off of Highway 55. And uh, I've got involved in this some months back uh, with some friends of mine, and it's uh, been one of the most uh, personal and, uh, and rewarding things so far, uh, and I'm sure it will continue to be that I've that I've ever been involved in when you consider how it got started and who started it and what it's going to be. Um, it's going to be a, a really a, a wonderful thing for Missouri and especially for the heartland of Missouri. Um, it would be it's a special thing, but what it is, is just simply a, um, a, a veterans memorial and we will have uh, about, there'll be maybe about 20, I think 27 acres total, I mean, 46 acres total of, uh, of, of uh, um, gardens that they can walk through. There'll be a cemetery there. There'll be museums. There'll be uh, uh, lots of uh, lots of uh, things to to take a look at and to uh, and to enjoy what uh, what the, the nation has done and and what these the veterans have done. So, uh, but anyway, it's uh, it, it's so much to explain. I hope that so much. I hope from that one would just go to our to our, our website and uh, and check it out uh, at m n v m fund f u n d dot org m n v m fund dot org and check it out it's a preliminary there'll be more and more coming on this site uh, as we start as we continue to improve the site but it's uh, uh, it's something that Missouri Missouri especially should be very proud of and will be very proud of and I'm honored to be. Uh, be a part of it and there's a lot of history to it depends on what you want to know about it but uh, it's a uh, it's a very uh, interesting history on how this got started through a gentleman named Jim Elliman, uh who was a, a wounded vet and just swore that when he got time and the money he would put together something for all of his comrades that all of his fellow servicemen that died during the war and uh, and that's what he's uh that's what he's done. He's not only got donated donated the land, but he's and donated several million dollars uh, to make this happen. So there's a lot to talk about, a lot to see, and uh, you can take it uh, this initial look at it uh, by looking at the site. But there's really much, uh, much, much more to come. So, uh, do you have a some type of charity event or some type of event coming up this Sunday? Yeah, we're coming up this Sunday where we're going down. We have the, the wall that's up down there. One of them features is going to be the Vietnam Wall. Uh, that's the exact replica of the one that's in Washington, D.C. And so this, uh, the, the concrete part of it is up, and, and along with a couple of other buildings are up. And, uh, and so, we're going to, so we're going to simply uh, invite people down, and we have a way of locating on the wall where a certain names will be. And uh, so we're asking people to come down who uh, have an interest and who want to have remember a loved one, and we have a way of locating on on the wall where that name will be, and they are welcome to put their name on the concrete wall uh, where where that uh, site would be, and then the uh, black mark uh, black uh, uh, walnut. I mean, granted, would be uh, put laid right over. It's all being printed now. And all the names are being put on. All 58,252 names are being uh, put on the granite now, and it will be laid over that name. So we have a way of finding where it'll be, the name will be on the wall, and then uh, then the granite will be put over that. So 
it's uh, just a ceremony and uh, an, an honor. I mean, a, an opportunity for loved ones to to uh, to remember yeah. uh, some of those people that they lost in the uh, war. Anybody who has been to the Vietnam War, in, uh, v- Vietnam uh, Memorial in, in, in Washington D.C., the Wall in Washington, it's one of the most somber places on, on earth. It is so magnificent and so moving uh i would recommend anybody going it but it sounds like that's what they're building something very similar down in perryville it's going to be an exact replica it's going to be the wall but the difference is that you're going to have a, uh, areas to reflect areas to, to really um uh, have some uh remembrance of what the war really meant and of your loved one and of what the time and place we were in history at the time it really was going to be a beautiful place to walk through and take a look at. We're going to have these. We just uh, just got a hold of some bell, big bells that are going to be put in a giant bell tower down there. Uh, we're going to have a, there'll be a museum in there. Museum of buildings. Some of those buildings are up now. Uh, we have to. We, there's some work going on the inside. There'll be another building that will be going up. But the main. The, but it would be just. It's just going to be. It is going to be the uh, the. The, the far most tribute to the uh, to the American soldier um, uh, that's out there. It's, it's just going to be that, and it'll be five. This will be years in the making. About five years will be finished, but they'll be as we get get it funded. But uh, if you as you, if you just to go down and, and come down and take a look at, at what it is right now, it's, a, it's inspiring enough. But I can't. It's just hard for me to imagine how inspiring it would be. Uh, when the thing when when it's finished, yeah. uh, so we I think it's something that Missouri is going to be very very proud of, and I know I'm proud to be a part of it. And so uh, uh, I'm just anxious to to get her going and get involved uh, a little bit more than I am, and, uh, and and see and see that it happens. All right, it's a Missouri's National Veterans Memorial, and it's in Prairieville, right. and the website is N M V M mnvmfund.org and you can donate right there on the site and there's a whole lot of great information about the who, what, when, where, why, and how. That's, that's right. And uh, all you do is if you want to get down to it, get, go to it, there's uh, exit 129 and you take a right and uh, it's in a five, about five miles down the road, take a left and there you are. So it's easy to get to. Anybody wants to come down, but uh, any more information, you can just go to that site and uh, uh, and give us a call, and we'll we'll let you know what's going on. N M N V M. So M N V M Fund dot O R G. Jackie Smith, you are always welcome here. Keep us up to date, and you ever want to come up and uh, talk about anything, you're always welcome here, my friend. That's very nice. It's great to talk to you, and thank you, thank you very much. You got, and we'll save your uh, D- uh, Danny Boy for the next time you're on the air. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> right, fair enough.